Uh, when I work with um, young people, um, that perhaps have got themselves into strife online through a social network, perhaps somebody's connected to them they shouldn't have connected to. Uh, I go and work with the boy or girl, and the first thing we do is delete their social networks, whether it's Facebook or Instagram or things like that. We're going to put them back on the internet, but we're going to make sure that we relaunch them uh, with a certain confidence that the child is going to start to broadcast. Number one, we get the child to create a list of family that they know, um, family members that they've got, uncles and aunts, and then we get them to list as many friends as they can that they know quite well. We create two lists. Then we recreate the social network and we will then invite the children to connect with the people on the two lists that they've connected to. What they've done then is mirrored exactly their social network off the internet and that's what they're trying to wrap themselves in when they're online. Uh, there is nothing wrong with that at all, of course, providing the people in the lists are actually out there on the internet. Number two, we then focus on the profile pictures that they are going to pro produce in their bio sections. It's really important that children, when they go online, adolescents and below, really important, that they don't make themselves look lonely or vulnerable. So what we encourage mom and dad to do is to get into the picture with the child, have the picture taken, make it fun, have some fun, get that shot online, and when anybody sees that child for the first time or chances upon them on the internet, they see that the child is connected to family. Very important message to send to the world. Number two, get their friends into their social network pictures as well. Then they are showing that they're connected to friends, family and friends and community. That's what you want to be concerned about when your child broadcasts themselves online. Those are the three categories that we want a child to be sort of expressing. Family, friends, community. When they go to barbecues and weddings, get pictures of uncle and aunts into those pictures. If they've got a social network or something like Instagram, get mom and dad and uncles to follow them and every now and again to drop messages into their accounts. Then if anybody gets into their networks, what they see is the presence of family. That is very important for a child. Thank you.